Hi guys, thanks for joining me again. If you're new to my channel, my name is Anne and on my channel, I review foreign international content. If you've been here before, you know what I like to say, right? We travel around the world, sitting on our couches. You never know which country we're gonna land next, right? And like I always say, we are not scared of that subtitle, right? If you get over that subtitle, you will open yourself to a lot of other many, 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 many shows. So if foreign shows is something you've never given a try, give yourself a chance. Um, just like the director of Korean drama, um, Parasite said, once you've contended with that one inch of the subtitle, then your world gets open to many, 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 many other shows. So I ask you to challenge yourself to uh, overcome the subtitle. That being said, once in a while, we get those shows where it just is international. And that's what Marvel is doing here. And I actually have to say at the beginning of this movie, when they do the history behind his story, it is in Chinese. So it, there is some subtitles, but most 90% almost 99% really is in English. So don't worry, don't worry about the subtitle right now, but in the beginning, just like, I don't know, three minutes, five minutes is in subtitle so that, you know, they explain it in their um, Chinese language, which I love, right? Because it makes it authentic. It's like they speak their language. I love that. It's so uh, much fun, but I love that Marvel uh, is doing another, I, I appreciate them pushing that diversity in giving an Asian all cast uh, actors show. You know, we all know how we loved Wakanda forever, Black Panther, it was nice to see a black cast. And here we go, Marvel is giving us Shang-Chi and what a fantastic movie. It just dropped yesterday, it's in the theaters. Uh, right now it's not in the streaming services yet. I believe, I think they should wait like a month or so before they can drop it in the streaming services. This is Marvel, so I'm assuming it probably come to Disney Plus. Uh, but, oh, a really fantastic movie worth every penny. Go and watch it in the movie theaters. You are not gonna regret the fight scenes, the music, the CGI. Oh, it comes through. You all know it's not the same when you watch a movie in a movie theater versus at home. Nothing against home, but this is definitely worth every penny. And I love the storyline. All the actors did a fantastic, fantastic job. This is the first time I'm seeing him, uh, this actor. So if you know of any other movies or shows he's done, I would love to see him again. His name is Sim Liu, and he's the one who is playing Shang Chi. And the story is told of his family, um, his dad's family, who's very wealthy and owns this uh, rings, 10 rings. Um, having those 10 rings makes them very powerful. They can fight anybody and conquer anything. Because of that, they've acquired a lot of wealth. And I really loved the actor who played his dad. Um, his name is Tony Liu, Luke. A uh, really excellent actor. So after acquiring a lot of wealth, it's almost like, you know, he wants more and more of a challenge. He finds this island, kind of a quiet place and meets this woman out there. And for once, she is able to challenge him in the fight scenes. Oh, that was so beautiful. It was almost like dancing and fighting. I was like, this is kind of romantic. And it would make sense that they did it that way because I mean, she, she wins him over and they end up falling in love and um, he convinces her to leave her beautiful island to come with him. And then she convinces him and says, you know, your family has acquired a lot of wealth with his rings. And let's just say some of the things they did have not been the best. How about you let go of the rings? I'll let go of my island. We live together as a normal family. And that's what they did. They end up uh, getting married and have two kids. They have a son. His name obviously is uh, Chang Chi and then his sister. And so they 
end up just living a normal life. They were going on with normal life. And then unfortunately, his enemies um, came after him and he wasn't home and kills his wife. So let's just say the whole movie is about him wanting revenge. And after his wife dies, he starts to train his son for we're gonna go and revenge mom. And if you want this 10 rings, to inherit this 10 rings, you're gonna have to earn them. So the amount of training you should see, the way they train him, oh my word. He is like hitting this tree, knuckles bleeding. They are hitting him. I mean, he said I, he was creating a human weapon, meaning he knew nobody could take his son down. And that's what he wanted. And he, oh boy, was he quite um, the fighter. Anyway, um, he's 14 years old and the dad goes, I found the person who killed your mom. And he goes, it's time for you to go and get him. When he goes to go uh, do that, he decides to run away. And then he had told his sister, I'm going to be gone for a few days and come back. He never comes back. And so when the sister is 16, she decides to run away from home. And let's just say, by the way, while the sister was watching him train, although she was not allowed to train, she would watch. And so she would also practice. And she became, woo! Talk about badass. She kicked butt like crazy. Anyway, so she runs away from home um, and he goes to uh, United States and um, just decides to live a normal life, changes his name, which by the way, changes his name from Shang-Chi to Sean. Okay, so in this movie, we have Aquafina. Oh, I love Aquafina. And I'm so glad, although it was a serious role for her, they still let her, you know, be still funny and comedic. Because I remember when um, they're good friends, they work together in this ballet uh, uh, restaurant, I believe, or a hotel. And when she, when he tells uh, her, you know, obviously about who he is and how he had to change his name. And he says, yeah, my name used to be Shang, so I changed it to Sean. And Aquafina's character was like, really, really? So let me get this straight, Sh Shang, Sean? Really, does not that sound like the same thing? Most people, when they're trying to hide, like completely change their name to like something not even close to their previous name. Anyway, I just love that they let her do her comedic stuff because sometimes when things would get very like serious, there's a lot of serious fight scenes and the story is really deep. Aquafina was there to always give us our comic relief as audience. I loved that she was there and did a fantastic job. Anyway, um, what happens is the dad was like, I always knew where they were. And if he was like, okay, I gave you 10 years to live your life, but now we're going to get serious and get back to family business. So let's just say the dad comes back for Shang-Chi and his sister. And they're like, we're going to need to go. He, the dad thought the per people who killed his mom were uh, from her island. So in his mind, we're going to go, they're the enemy, we're going to go uh, destroy them. So let's just say for Chang Chi, he has to decide, is he his uh, mother's son or his father's son or is he both? What is he going to do? Is he going to choose between good and evil? You have to watch. It's just fantastic movie excellent worth even a sequel and obviously because it's the marvel franchise i love that at the end of the uh, movie you know they're being welcomed into like the marvel family if you will that was kind of fun to see because that tells me that we're gonna see more of them maybe with the other marvel characters you, you know how they kind of combine that i love that but what a fantastic movie do yourself a favor get to the theaters and watch shang Chi, really fantastic, excellent cast. Everybody did a fantastic uh, job. It was very well directed and produced. I loved everything. Uh, once again, thank you so much for joining me. If you love the video, give me a 
uh, thumbs up uh, do subscribe it does help to uh, support my channel and I'll see you again when I'm reviewing another excellent foreign international show deuces